It's called The Chinese Football Dream, and as far as TV shows go, they don't get much bigger. In September, this new reality program will air on 18 television networks in China to a potential audience of half a billion people. And today, the show's 17 stars were living their dream at Everton's training academy, picked from hundreds of Chinese teenagers to live the life of a Premier League footballer. We've been over in China in the summer and uh, the tail end of last year, just uh, identifying the, the, the best young kids. It's more like a TV reality show, uh, the Chinese football dream. Uh, but it gives it the kids an experience of coming to a professional football club. They didn't have passwords, they not even a lot of cases left their village. I mean, they've watched on TV, you know, these types of clubs. They've seen it in the movies, so to speak, and now they are calling back to their parents and grandparents that we are actually living what we only imagined. But as the players were taught the nuances of our national game, it didn't take long for them to experience the national weather either. Tell us what it's like to play football here in England. Is it is it different to how it is in China? Um, here it's quite cool, sometimes a bit too cool, it's a bit cold. At the moment, China is quite hot, it's over, uh, it's almost 40 at some places. It's so cold. But this, after all, is a cultural exchange, as Everton legend Graham Sharp learnt earlier this year. Let me tell you, uh, when we were in China, uh, they had us doing some extraordinary things. Uh, so people want to go on social network sites and see some of the things they had us doing, they're more than welcome to. It was an experience for us as well. An experience that these teenagers, and possibly that panda, will never forget. <whistles> Daniel Hewitt, ITV News.